welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here today. My name is Joss, and if you love to talk about fragrance and perfume, you've come to the right place, and I hope you consider subscribing. I also hope you consider following me on TikTok and Instagram, where I also talk about perfume. Today, I'm really excited to bring you my current favorites. So I'm gonna be talking about fragrance, makeup, and a couple other things here. I don't post monthly favorites necessarily, but I like to update you on my favorites from time to time. So do you have a favorites playlist if you're interested? It is in my playlist tab or link down below. I'm gonna start with fragrance, of course. So one that is a current favorite is from Van Cleef & Arpels. This is Orchidée Vigny. This has been widely talked about on YouTube and it's pretty popular. Maybe for the past year, maybe two years, it's a gorgeous, florally vanilla as you would imagine and it's just a great fragrance it doesn't have great lasting power but i love using this one for layering and i will frequently top things off with this it's a really versatile fragrance that really goes with so many different things so i really love this one that's orchidea Bini from van cleef and arpels extraordinaire collection the next one is newish to me but this is toy boy from moschino and it's got this very <laughs> very Moschino um, packaging, but it's a very great fragrance. I love this. It is marketed to men, but it is incredibly gender neutral. It's beautiful. It's, it's so delicious and spicy, easy reach, beautiful. It's got okay longevity. It's, I get about five hours from this and it's just such a beautiful fragrance. I really love it and it's fairly affordable. So I really love this one and I love wearing it. Um, the packaging doesn't bother me. I think it's kind of quirky and fun. So, um, and I think my husband's worn it too a little bit, but I really love Toy Boy from Moschino and I think I got mine on fragrancebuy.ca. This is another thing I got on fragrancebuy.ca. This is from Jenny Glow. This is Mimosa and Cardamom Cologne and this is a dupe for Jo Malone's Mimosa Cardamom. And it's, it's very, beautiful. I don't know that I've actually smelled the Jo Malone version, but this is so gorgeous. I have to believe this is pretty close to it. Um, I did compare the Jenny Glow English Pear and Freesia with the Jo Malone version, and I have a video I'll put up in the cards, but those were very similar, and I'm assuming this is too. In any case, I love it. It's beautiful. It's very spicy. It's got those warm spices like cardamom, and mixed with the florals, I think it's gorgeous. I think this is around $15. Um, I may have gotten this in a set. I either get these little one ounces or I get them in a set with a candle. Either way, it's either like 15 or 25 with the candle. So I love this. It's a great value and it's a beautiful fragrance. Again, another good one for layering, but it's just beautiful. This is from Oil Perfumery and this is their impression of Tom Ford's Lost Cherry. And I did have a decant of Lost Cherry. Um, and this to me is very, very close. It's got the almond note, which I think is really an important component of Tom Ford's Lost Cherry and what makes it so beautiful and special. Um, the thing I don't like about Lost Cherry is the longevity and the price. So those two things together just don't jibe for me. <laughs> but I love this. This is great for layering. It's beautiful. It's long lasting. If you love Tom Ford Lost Cherry, I think this is only about $15. It's gorgeous and it's only $15 for this third of an ounce and I think this will last a long time because like I said, the fragrance itself lasts a long time and you don't need that much. So it's beautiful. I've been really impressed with the purchases that I've gotten on oil perfumery and I think they're a great value and they're just a great complement to so many um, other fragrances. So again, this is the oil perfumery impression of Tom Ford Last Cherry. And the last fragrance related item that I have is from Victoria's Secret. This is Bare Vanilla La Creme Body Lotion. This is a beautiful vanilla body lotion. It has vanilla orchid and spun sugar and it's just really beautiful. You get a little bit of the floral, very strong vanilla. It layers beautifully. I'm wearing this today and I'm layering it with a couple other fragrances and it's beautiful. Um, I think it's still available on Victoria's Secret website. I really love it. It's um, it's just super versatile. It goes with so many different things. That's kind of a theme with me. I just love versatility and things that you can layer with different things and coming up with fun new combinations. This one is fabulous and I recommend it. I want to talk about my earrings because um, these are some gold, not real gold, <laughs> earrings that I got on Amazon. I think they were around $15, but I have like several different pairs that are similar with little variations and I'll just take it off so you can see what this one looks like. Um, I just love these earrings. They're so, so these have the little droplets and, but I have ones that have like a little spoke that hangs down. And then I have ones that have a, a snake. I've got like a few different 
variations on these um, and I just really love these and I think they're a great deal and um, just super easy, super simple, kind of classy and you know just an easy, easy thing to put on especially when I wear my hair up, I really like to wear earrings. So um, these little Amazon earrings, I'll put the link down below. I don't have an affiliation with Amazon, but I really do love these earrings that I've been getting there. Then I've got some makeup. So the first thing is lashes. So I am not obviously wearing these lashes, but this is AOA and I have worn these lashes. And AOA is kind of like dollar store online. I just placed my first order and actually the company is called Shop Miss A. I'll link that down below. So I placed my first Shop Miss A order and I got a few pairs of their lashes. This is the Melissa variety and they're $1.55 a pair. So it's really cheap. They're faux mink. Um, I, I really like these. I wore these in a recent video. I think I wore these in my recent wish list video, but I'm really impressed for $1.55 for a pair of lashes. And they're they're pretty high quality so I feel like I'm gonna get multiple wears I try to get multiple wears out of lashes um, currently I'm wearing like ColourPop something um, I got like a, a variety pack around the holidays from ColourPop but these are really good um, this is the first one that I've tried from AOA and very impressed very good deal and I just love lashes they're so fun. <laughs> they're so fun the, this is more of kind of a natural um, style. The ones I'm wearing today are much more dramatic style, but I love them. And um, so yeah, that's one new kind of lashes. This is the NYX Epic Ink Liner. And so this is an eyeliner. I'm wearing it today. So when you wear lashes, you really have to do, um, it looks like that. It's just got a kind of like a, almost a magic marker tip. Um, this is special packaging. I think normally it just comes in a black um, packaging, but when you wear lashes, you really have to put I don't do wing liner because I've got, you know, aging eyes. So I've got some wrinkles, so I can't really do a wing, but I definitely have to do a line so I can have a guide for my lashes. And so this is a great liner. It's very inexpensive and you can usually find it on sale at Ulta. Like you'll get, sometimes they have 40% off. Sometimes they have buy one, get one 50% off. They have different deals, but I think the regular price is around $7.99 for this liner and it lasts quite a while. And I've gone through several of these. But I really love this NYX Epic Ink Liner. It's awesome. Other eye product is this e.l.f. Shadow Stick. So this is called the e.l.f. No Budge Shadow Stick and this is in the color Rose Gold. And I'm wearing it today. It's kind of hard to see but I'm using it as kind of an inner corner highlight and I really like this. It's um, I think it's only like four or five dollars and it's just a super convenient thing that you can um, use for your inner corner highlight or you can use it as eyeshadow. So it's really versatile and pretty and simple and it comes in a few different colors and I think it's a good deal and I really like this so this is another one and then for blush this is from BH Cosmetics and this is one of their little blush quads it looks like this I love this I just love this blush quad I'm wearing it today um, so this is called chocolate orange truffle fork color blush palette and it comes they have like I don't know, maybe five or six different combinations. I happen to love this color combination. It's very peachy. Um, it's really peach. And I usually use all the colors together. The only problem, and it's a beautiful formula, the only problem I have with this is I love it so much, I tend to over apply <laughs> when I'm using it. But I just think, and I can't remember how much this was. I'll put the price up on the screen, but this was fairly affordable. BH Cosmetics is a pretty affordable brand. And it's just a great deal. It comes in, like I said, different color combinations. I just love this. And um, I'd probably be happy wearing this almost every day. Um, I think they're they're mostly matte, except for this one, I think has a little bit of a sheen, but it's not sparkly. It's just got a little bit of a tiny sheen to it. Otherwise they're matte, but it's a great product, great formula. I really like BH Cosmetics. Those are my current favorites and I would love to hear about yours down in the comments. Be sure to share your favorites of the moment, whether it's fragrance or makeup or skincare or anything else for that matter, earrings, jewelry, and I hope you're doing well and staying safe and healthy. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Feel free to give it a thumbs down if you didn't and I'll see you again soon. Thanks so much.